The next um, on my list is the dual ended dotting pin rhinestone stud picker wax pencil. And it is this item here. I'm going to take it out. But well, this is what it came in with this packaging. I have such a hard time sometimes picking it up with the orange stick. And um, like I said, at times I can be visually challenged. <coughs> Okay, I'm back. I got the um, item out. Here's the item. That's the end that you, of course, will pick up the rhinestones. If you have glitters, you can just use this to brush the excess or to brush it off of your nails. So that's a great little tool, all in one. Alright, uh, then the next one is sold by Time underscore Global. And I have the Dual End UV Painting Gradient Brush Sponge Stamper Pen. And I also got the, the other one. I got two of those. But one of them has like a stamper. Um... This is what they came in. If you can see that. This is what they came in. This first one here. And I'm going to open that up. It just has different sponges. The different sizes. On that. Now I got the clear. Of course you can get whatever color you choose. But this end has more. If you can see that tip. It has more like a dome end. And then this end is more rounded so I guess with this end it can you can get more intricate with the, the edges and this end is more blunt more round all right and I'm gonna put that back in its casing and then I've got of course the replacement sponges this next one is pretty much the same um, but this end here, of course, it's the same with the sponge. It's the rounded end. But this one, you can use it to stamp small images. So I'm going to be happy to try these out. I saw that um, Keong Lee had something similar to this. I don't know if it's the same product. I know she uses a, buys a lot of products from Lantern and Wren. But I got these off of uh, eBay. So I'm, I've been tr wanting to try out gradients. Um, it's gonna use. I have done it, but I haven't videoed a gradient that I that I've done. But um, with that, it's gonna be helpful to do to use and do the gradient. So I'm gonna test that out, and I'm of course gonna show that in a video. Um, let's see. The next from them is a clear rectangular silicone jelly nail stamper with scraper but this scraper I don't know why I thought it was a little bigger than what it was <laughs> but it's not it's just a square scraper I mean square uh, stamper a square stamper and it and it I thought it came with a cap it does not this is this base here is hollow nothing there but uh, I'm going to see how well this stamps. I'm going to test that out. But what impressed me was the scraper. And the scraper has images on it. And I don't know. Let me see if I can show it to you better on this background. The black. This is what I used to water marble with y'all. But to see if you can see it a little bit better. But it has images on it. So I'm going to try to see in... And it's like it's acrylic. So I'm going to see if I can do those images um, and test that out for you all um, in a swatch video. That would be something I would like to test. So I'll do that. I've got a lot planned. So I'm going to be testing a lot of this stuff out and uh, sharing it with you. I thought that was so cute. 
Uh, let's see. I've got these holographic nail polish glitter laser rainbow hologram varnish from Barn, Born Pretty. Can't talk, y'all. And I hope I've gotten these right because I took them out of the boxes and I don't know if I got the boxes mixed up. But y'all bear with me. If you know the colors, let me know if I've said a wrong color for, for an item. But they come in these boxes. And this one is Shine in the Dark. Isn't that pretty? This one is a, a dark grayish. But it's got like purple I just can't even explain it y'all it's gorgeous all the holographic polishes are gorgeous I can't wait 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 to play with these and I'm wearing something purple tomorrow so I'm going to use that one this one is H005 I'm sorry the other one was H001 this one's H005 Dream Girls and I'm going to um Put a description of everything that I purchased in the description box. It's going to be pretty long, but I'm going to do it. Pretty pink. Very pretty. Very pretty. And I love the pink holographic polishes. They are just gorgeous. This next one is gorgeous blue. Everything is just beautiful. H007. Ocean Kingdom. Oh, guys, I wish you could really see this because if you can, that is just beautiful. And that's why I put this black background so you all can kind of see things a little bit better. Um, this is beautiful. All right, the next one is H003 Temptation Weight. This is a beautiful green. Really pretty. Alright, I have the H004 a Magnificent Time. This is more of a coral color. And the last one is All Embracing. And this is the purple I was telling you about. I've got to I've got to wear that tomorrow. It's just beautiful. Just beautiful. I am going to do a swatch on the each one's going to be separate the separate kiss the separate uh born pretty polishes i'm going to do those swatches um i'm sorry I, I told you i had one more i've got a couple more i'm sorry h004 i mean h006 i'm sorry this is together forever and this is kind of like a, I don't know, light, silverish, pinky, blue, um, I don't know. It's just gorgeous. I love holographic polishes, so I can't even describe what color that is. But it is very pretty. That's why we need to do the swatches. And the last one is Magic Rainbow. This is the one that's the silver um, holographic. So that is a total of eight bottles that I got. And the next item on the list is sold by La Ferreta or La Ferreta, L A F O R E T A. And I purchased the 12 piece nail art transfer foil stick stickers. And then they came with the nail glue. I got two of the nail glues. They come with it. And I'm just going to take these out. Here's a holographic silver. All of these are beautiful. This is like a gradient blue green. Pretty. green this one is a blue it's like stars this is just a plain gold 
I've been wanting nail foils for a while too. This is another gradient with the pink and the red and the purple. And this is just a holographic pink. This is a animal print. Cute. These are little holographic circles. I know y'all hear my dogs barking out there. I love this one. It's like the little dry brush swatches I do on my nails when I do a manicure sometimes. That's pretty as well. A rainbow of colors. Then I've got the pink and the red. So that was a 12 piece. Okay, the next item is from, I'm going to spell this, H-U-A-S-H-A-R-E-N-M-I-N, -E 2013. I don't know what that is, but <laughs> I got the um, three-piece nail tips display for practicing, so when I have a manicure I want to do but I've already done it on my nails I'll just do it on these practice stands and then I um, purchased the nail tips to go on there as well and that was from Tang Tang AW5 and I bought two of these 100 piece sets so that should last me a while and the next are the is from H U L W Y Y G 2017 09201 and I've got the Born Free stamping polishes which you may have seen me use already in some other videos but that's the white the black Still got some tape on it. Something. The silver. The gold. And the red. And. I have a. Um, practice mat. And it really surprised me when it came in. I didn't pay. That's what you have to do, guys. Is read your description. Didn't pay attention to the measurements. And I don't seem to have it on my list here. I guess I didn't print it out. But I did receive my mat. I don't know who it, who it sold by. but And then when I was getting it out of the, the package and didn't realize what it was, I ended up tearing this in but this the the mat I was so shocked to see how small it was y'all but uh it's okay <laughs> it, it'll do what I need it to do I really needed something with a black background on it um especially when I'm doing white and then because sometimes I get tired of using my uh nail wheels Okay, I'm back, guys. My camera just went out for some reason. But anyway, uh, I wanted to get something with that so I wouldn't have to just use my swatch wheels all the time. So I got that. And these were a couple of items I didn't purchase. They were just in my my bag. But these little, these little stickers here, these little uh, decals really cute but I didn't recall purchasing that and I didn't purchase that and then I got this item as well that came in my packaging uh